All right, so hello, welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. It is me, Destiny, and this is yet another LP that I'm dying to get started with. So this is Miss Dakota Sawyer, and this is her beautiful farm. Um, so it was not originally her farm, of course. Um, she is a young adult. She just became a young adult not too long ago, um, but it was her mom and dad, so Anthony and Catherine, had this farm here. And so Miss Dakota here is unfortunately having to take it over because her parents have now passed away. So she is she is now going to be running the farm because she feels like it's the only thing that she can do to remain close to her parents because for them, the farm was everything. Like they enjoyed it so much. Um, they loved their farm animals and then they passed so suddenly um, that she has nothing left of them except for to tend the farm and try to make it as amazing as her parents dreamed of it being um, before they had died. So yeah, so this is going to be the most wholesome, wholesome LP I have done yet. Um, I'm so freaking excited to be with the cows and then we also got little chickens over here that are so stinking cute as well. So we're gonna go ahead and feed them. And then I don't think they're ready for eggs quite yet because I did do a little bit of playing with them off screen just to get um, just to get everything ready for this LP. So she has a little bit of um, depression left from her parents passing away. So hopefully she can get over that quite quickly. And then we have, okay, if he would stop moving, one sec. <laughs> and then we have Mr. Cash right here. So what is a farm without some farm animals, am I right? So this is the Australian Shepherd Cash. Um, we have a cutie pie little bumpkin right here, Mr. Pumpkin, after a cat that I had in my family growing up. And then we have this red healer over here. Her name is Ruby, also named after a dog that I did have and unfortunately do not have any longer. So yeah, so that is the family that we have so far. I'm so freaking excited. Let me know what you guys are thinking, what we should do, what we should get into um, in the future. So what I'm going to do is of course, tend to all of the animals. She already really likes the bees, which is the first because I've never really played with bees. Um, but she likes them and she wants to like bond with them even more. Um, she only has these two skills, which is charisma and gardening level one from planting these. And she wants to be a freelance botanist. So she got the planting one and then we just need to wait until they need to be weeded or watered 10 times so we can get that taken care of as well. So she's just gonna run off and take a shower. She is very sad about her parents, uh, but thankfully it's not damp putting a damper on her mood um, because it did happen quite a while ago um, and she is now just deciding that this is gonna be her life. And so I'm super freaking excited to get going on this journey, see what she gets into. So first things first, we're gonna come over here and see if any of the plants need tending. So we can go ahead and harvest everything that needs to be harvested and then we'll sell it on the um, little selling table thing in the baby. So she's gonna do this and I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, and then I'm thinking for us to get started on a little bit of money. How is she negative $7,000? What? Um, I'm gonna give her like zero dollars. <laughs> so to get started, I'm gonna have her come straight over here and start selling her milk and everything like that that we just gathered. That would be really freaking good. So we can make a little bit of money, please, because we're gonna have to look after ourselves. Um, with zero dollars, we need to get this farm rolling and rolling. So I'm gonna have her come over here and stock the table. Let's see how much money we can make right quick, please, shall we? 
She's having cravings because as all the Sims, they automatically start their period as soon as they start any game. So love that for her. That's extremely exciting. Oh my God, look at her outfit. What a queen. Okay, so we are going to stock the table. I think we already did that. We're gonna stock the table and then we're gonna go ahead and tend it. Yes, ma'am. Start the yard sell. Um, we need to mark up the prices about 100%. Nothing too crazy. A lot of people do 300%, but we're not going to do quite that. Um, so, okay, let's see if we can have anybody show up, please. Yes, there she goes. Please come and buy our stuff. Oh, yes. And then I'd al I also need her to meet some people so she can go ahead and... Give him a sales pitch, see what he thinks. We can go ahead and give her a sales pitch. Okay, yes, we're on our period. Okay, The Sims has no chill. Oh, they're not liking us because we stink. Well, that's not our fault, excuse me. Give her a sales pitch as well. I know we stink, okay? Relax. Y'all are so annoying, so hateful. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at all these cutie pies. Okay. Demetrius is really cute. Are we tending the table? We are. Um, so we got one thing sold so far. Ma'am, excuse me. You are not going in our house. Um, so let me just go ahead and make sure that the door is locked. Lock door for everyone but Dakota. <laughs> okay, we can resume. She is so pretty. GG. You're pretty pretty. Say hi. Um, nobody's liking us because we stink, but don't mind that, please, and thank you. But I, if y'all could just buy some stuff and we make some money, we could be out of your way and we don't have to be stinky anymore, please, and thank you. We just need to make sales, guys. Come on. Everyone is feeling really disrespected because we stink, but... That's no, don't like leave us alone. Like, do you see this farm? We're running this all on our own, and you not buying our stuff is not helping us at all. So, could you please buy some milk? <laughs> um, and then let's give a sales pitch to all these people. She really has to pee, but she's gonna have to wait because we're trying to make some money, honey. What is she thinking about? Envious. Okay, so she is a jealous sim. It's hard to see other couples together when you don't have anyone special in your life. Oh, baby girl, stop it. She'll be fine. That's sad. Okay, are we are we giving sales pitches? Excuse me. We need to give sales pitches. I'm not interested in all this conversation. I'm interested in buying my milk. That's all I need y'all to do, please. Oh, she's about to pee herself. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, okay. Um, no. I don't want her to pee herself because I don't want her to die of embarrassment. So, <laughs> go ahead and come in here and use the bathroom immediately before you pee yourself. Oh my gosh. My bad. I didn't realize it was getting so bad. And then go ahead and use a tampon and a pad. Double up, my love. You're not chatting with Anthony. He's not even supposed to be here. Use the bathroom. What are you doing? What is going on? <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> She's saying a ghost is in here and I don't even see him. Okay, freaking use the potty, you crazy thing. Aw, he said we look nice today? Who was that? Wait, who said we looked nice? I think it was Demetrius. Aw, that's so cute. What is this? Why is all, their f all this food out? Okay, go ahead and eat this so you don't have to pay for it. That would be good. Um, everyone is apparently leaving. Then we have a half-eaten omelet. I actually eat the omelet because this is still completely good. So go ahead and put that away once you're done with that. Where is all this stuff coming from? 
Oh my, oops. My gosh, and I'm so sorry if you can hear like thunder and lightning, it is storming like no other out, so don't mind us. <laughs> Baby, can you stop being dramatic, please? Oh my gosh. And then you need to go ahead and fill all the pet bowls. <laughs> we have so many, where did this come from? Oh my God. Anthony, I don't even see you. Can you leave? Where is he? Oh my god, what is going on? Where did this come from? Where is all the food coming from? <laughs> my gosh, what is going on? We need to lecture him about eating human food. Please, go ahead and do that. And then we need to put this away. Whoever is co oh my god, the ghost is here and I cannot see him. Oh my god. He needs to stop cooking. How how am I supposed to like release him to the nether worlds or whatever? I don't have his freaking Well hey, we never have to pay for food, so that's exciting, I guess. Question mark, what is going on? Anthony, leave us alone. I know that you're our dad and like you went you left the world too soon, but relax. We're trying to tend the farm and you wanna freaking drive us crazy with all this food and everything. Stop. <laughs> Can't take it. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and go milk this farm, this um, other cow, and then we're gonna go ahead and add it to the table as well. And well, okay, maybe we should put it in our inventory. So we'll go clear the table, put everything away, because it is getting towards dinner. I meant bedtime now. So go clear the table. And then we'll go inside, tend to the pups, and head off to bed. Stop being dramatic, and we're fine. Here we go. This. We're gonna go ahead and call all the pets inside. We're going to give him, oh, we're gonna go give Ruby Girl a comforting hug. Our little baby. Oh, I love her so much. And then Mr. Cash, named after Johnny Cash, of course. And then I don't know if the cat's gonna listen to us. He normally does not uh, because he just doesn't care, I guess, whatever. <laughs> um, and then we're going to go ahead. Oh, she's in an inspired mood. Okay, but she is dead tired. And this is her room up here. I didn't do much um, CC editing and stuff like that just because I don't really have a lot of CC for like decoration and stuff like that. I normally just use like base game or like the packs and stuff and then all my CC is for my Sims. So yeah, that's how I normally play it, and a thunderstorm is moving its way in, so again, if you can hear it, I'm so sorry, but she's gonna go off to bed, and I'll see y'all in the morning. All right, so she's gonna go ahead and get up right now. Uh, I wanted her to get up a little bit earlier, but she was being stubborn, and her sleeping was going up so slowly, so she had a little sleep in until seven. She's gonna go ahead and go to the bathroom and then let's go see if Anthony made any more food. He did make food, but he ate it and then left his plate for us to clean up. So love that, that is outstanding. So freaking exciting. <laughs> and then we'll go ahead and since dad made so much food for us, which is absolutely amazing, love that. Yeah, Anthony made that. Oh, Catherine came. Okay, so our mom and dad made us so much food which is very sweet. We're gonna go ahead and go eat it and not have to worry about paying for anything. That's so cute, aw. They're making sure their daughter doesn't have to pay for anything until she gets on her feet. So that's very sweet, love that. And she is in a very feisty mood, so she's gonna have a bad time. She also is worried about her health, so she wants to go have a health checkup. Uh, we don't really have the money for it, but I guess that's something that could be or is important. Um, so let me see where that's at. We can go ahead and schedule an appointment. Just kidding, I haven't placed the things yet, so sorry babe, you cannot do that. Okay, so right after she finishes eating, she needs to come out here and go ahead and ask the cows about their day just so we can maintain a good relationship with them that's going to be important please love 
and Anthony needs to stop messing with us because I have no way to release him to the netherworlds because um, it didn't leave me his urn, which is annoying. Okay, so I'm gonna have her run over here, stock the table, because we need to make some money. Ruby is hungry, you can help her by, by giving her food. What, is there no food in there? Surely. What the heck, there's food right here, baby. Okay, call Ruby to eat. No wait, that's not her bowl. We need to call Ruby to eat, call Cash to eat. This is crazy, how do they not know to eat? Oh, they, she can't reach it. Oh, baby. Okay, good, she can eat now. So go ahead and fill that bowl. We need to fill this bowl, stop being dramatic. <laughs> and then, oh, look, a lot of this stuff has gone off. But let's see if we can sell it all the same. That's gross, but hey, money is money. If they can't see that it's expired, why should we care? <laughs> Start yard sale, mark up the prices to 75% this time since some of them are expired. And let's see what we can't make. Oh, yay. Okay, so people are starting to show up. Let's go ahead and give some sales pitches. Oh, the guy that said that we were cute is back again. Hi. Oh my God, what a cutie pie. How oh, precious. I love him. Um, excuse me, that's rude. Give everyone a sales pitch, see who will buy something. Come on, Demetrius, you think we're cute, so you might as well like spend some money. Show us you're really about that life. Oh, she looks like a punk. Eliza, you look like a total e hole. So, we're just gonna give sales pitches. Um, I'm not sure why we're like, not liking anybody so far, but I don't really care as long as they're buying stuff. That is all that we need you guys to do, please. No one is wanting to buy anything. Come on. We even marked everything down for you. Jordan looks cute. I don't know who just bought something, but I appreciate your time. Appreciate it very much. Okay, so I think the yard sale has ended. Whatever. <laughs> Let's go ahead and clear the table, please. And then anything that was um, spoiled, we'll go ahead and throw away. there neighbor do I hear the sizzle of something broken you might because the freaking ghosts are apparently in there destroying everything so you absolutely might so we're gonna go ahead and just sell this stuff right here wow it's worth a lot of money but I don't know it won't let me separate what is it what is spoiled and what is not spoiled so I'm just gonna sell it there and we got a good chunk of money which is very very good she's going to grab even more milk love that for us and then let's see what is everyone doing in here oh my gosh okay well whatever <laughs> we're going to go ahead and go on a jog with him so this is going to be very exciting we have two dogs to go on jogs for and everything so two dog two dogs to go on jogs with on jogs with <laughs> and then we have a cat that needs love and affection so hurry up love what are you doing okay so we're off on jog number one <laughs> and then when we get back we have to go on yet another jog so okay there goes jog number one now for jog number two so we're going to go on another jog with um, Miss Ruby. Okay, and five years later, we are off with Miss Ruby Girl. She is very talkative. She's absolutely loving this. I want her to start her mornings at about 5 a.m. and then she's gonna stop work at, where's the cat? Ew. Okay, little glutton thing. She's, oh, sorry, I'm getting distracted. She's gonna start her days at about 5 a.m. and then she's going to stop work, stop working on the farm at about like 
7 p.m., 6 p.m. or 7 p.m., I'm thinking. That's about 12 hours of good work. But it takes so long to do everything that it's really getting, it's going to be stressful to, like, get everything that needs to be done when it needs to be done, you know what I mean? But that is the plan. That's what I would like to do so that she stops about 5 or 6 p.m. so that she has time to have 10 broken objects on The Sims Y. What is broken? Are you serious? Oh, my God. But yeah, that'll give her time to give her animals love and affection as well. Everything that they're going to need. Let me try to find these broken items. <laughs> um, that'll give her time to fix, to do everything around the farm that needs to be done, hopefully. Um, and then we'll spend time with the animals after that. Oh, it's all these sprinklers out here. Lovely. get to that later. <laughs> and then after she gets out, she's going to need to go ahead and go to the bathroom. I think she is still on her period, so go ahead and replace the pad and use the tampon. And then, okay, mom and dad are like, they're, yeah, they're cleaning for us, but then they're saying like, eh, clean up after us. So they're not really making our job any easier, I must say. So she's gonna go ahead and eat the food though um, after she takes care of herself and cleans up after mom and dad's mess. And then we're going to have to go to bed. So nothing fun got done today because the pups took five million years on their walk. All right, so we're finally setting down to talk, apparent oh, to eat, but apparently we're not. Anthony, leave us alone. Honey, you are dead. Get out. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> we haven't trained the pups to poop outside. Oh my goodness. That is the worst thing I have seen all freaking day. Are you, why is Pumpkin running away? No, where is he? No, 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 no. Can I stop him? Pumpkin, what's wrong? Pumpkin, don't do it. Pumpkin, no, oh my gosh. This is the worst thing that's happened all day. Pumpkin, that's too, what the heck were y'all just doing? <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, we need to teach you to go potty. So go ahead and put him, put Mr. Cash on a leash. We need to take him over here. So hurry up, please, love, so he doesn't go potty in the house. And then encourage Cash to do his business outside. Yes. Okay, we need to get these puppies trained 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 okay lovely and then go ahead and praise him for going to the potty outside and then we're gonna have to make, wake up miss ruby because i want to make sure that she knows to go to the potty outside as well we have pulled an all-nighter at this point this is ridiculous okay and then encourage ruby to do her business ridiculous ridiculous nice she's taking a poop great we love that for us and then go ahead and pet her where did the poop go? Oh, she hasn't gone yet. Okay, lovely, look at that. Um, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and throw it away for her so it makes everything easier. Oh, she stepped in it before I grabbed it, sorry. That was your fault, not mine. <laughs> and then um, I don't know how much it is to spay a dog, but we're gonna go ahead and take her to get spayed because we the last thing we need is freaking puppies, okay? So let's travel with Ruby and head out. All right, so we finally made it. Whoa, wow. Okay, how do we get in? <laughs> uh, oh, okay, so we finally made it. We're gonna go ahead and 
sign Ruby in for spaying. And then while we're here, we're gonna kill two birds with one stone. And after she gets taken in, we're gonna go ahead and take our little butts to take a few power naps so that we can go home and get on the business because we pulled an all nighter and here we are, we still haven't even slept. So why would you shush that lady? She's dead tired, poor thing. Ruby's like, let's go mom, let's go mom. I'm ready, I'm ready. <laughs> So we're waiting for the vet. Um, a vet will be with you soon to spay your pet with state-of-the-art technology. Lovely. She's going to go ahead and go in there and take a sleep. Well, actually, I don't want her to sleep. I want her to take a power nap. So she's going to go ahead and go take a power nap. Go take a power nap. You don't need to see what's happening. And then Ruby is off to get freaking spayed. Oh my gosh, this is so scary. She just goes in there? Is she in there right now? <gasps> oh my gosh. I hate it. I hate it, but we need it because we cannot have puppies. She's been spayed. This means they that they cannot make babies anymore. Through the magic of technology, the surgery station can be used to reverse this procedure. Oh, okay. Oh, look at her in her little cone. What a cutie pie. Oh, we're going to have to go over here and praise her and tell her that it's okay. We can't give her a kiss because she has the cone of shame on. Poor thing. We can get to know her. Look at our baby. We can't even take the cone off. Oh, and then let's have a talk to her. She's so cute. I love her. Okay, and animal care. Oh, from the animal lover trait. She loves taking care of the pets. That's so cute. We're going to purchase some pet items um, so we can get some wellness treats so that my puppies and kitties never have to deal with anything again. We're gonna get 10 wellness treats and then we'll go ahead and head home with our baby girl. Okay, so we are back. I'm gonna have to go ahead and get her in here to eat the food that she has not been able to eat yet. Um, and then we need to go ahead and give the pups some love because I don't want them running away as well. Please don't, I cannot handle it. So we're going to give them some praise and just give them some loving so that they know that they're loved. Oh, look at him stretching. <laughs> okay, and then yes, yes, the pet is missing. We need to go ahead and post a report or something for the missing pet. I'm not really sure how to do that. Uh, Post alert about our missing kitty so that he comes home soon because now we're freaking depressed about that. And then he, uh, wait. And then um, we'll go ahead and train Miss Ruby to play fetch because she keeps carrying the ball around. She seems very interested in learning. All right, so we're gonna teach her to play. See how quickly she learns with her little cone on. What a baby. She's so freaking cute. And then right after, we'll go ahead and, oh my gosh, you're gonna be a mess when you get home, Cash. We're going to go ahead and train him. To, oh, he already knows how to fetch, awesome. We're gonna train him to speak because I have yet to hear him speak. Oh, she's so sad because she has the cone of shame. Oh, baby girl. It's okay. Give her a praise. She's so cute. Okay, she just like decided not to do anything that I told her to do. See, this is the problem. They don't listen to me. Train him to speak. Why are you going all the way up here? What are y'all doing? Okay, so we're training. Mr. Cash as well. We need to make sure to get time to the animals because I learned the hard way and uh, lost 
lost a cat, so I'm upset. <laughs> and then we'll continue training um, Miss Ruby, if she'll allow it. Um, we're gonna go ahead and train him to go potty outside again. So I need, I need to go ahead and leash him. And encourage Cash to do his business out here. And then we're gonna have to encourage Ruby as well. So call Ruby out here too. Good job. Okay, one dog down. <laughs> and then we need to also ask her to go potty. Good job, little chickens. Can we remove the cone now? Is that what it said? <gasps> remove the cone. Lovely. Okay, so they can have the cone off. We're going to go ahead and throw away the poop before we step in it. And then let's come over here and see if any of the plants need taking care of. Uh, no, but everything is broken. So let's repair everything. Love this for us. This is just what she signed up for early this morning, you know? <laughs> this is exactly it. All right, so here our queen is <laughs> repairing away. Um, so this should get her skill up pretty quickly. Um, I don't think you can die from repairing these things, so I guess we will find out. Hopefully not, because she has a lot of repairing to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and move this along and I will see you when she's done. <laughs> oh my goodness, the dog is so disgusting. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and stop her repairing right there because um, everything is a mess right now. So she's going to finish repairing that last one that she's doing. I think that um, Pumpkin is back home as well, which is freaking amazing. Thank goodness. We're definitely going to have to give them more attention now. So give him a comforting hug. What's wrong with Cash? Little baby, what's wrong with you? Is it because you're dirty, little bumpkin? Ask him what's wrong, and then we need to give him a comfort, her a comforting hug as well. Just give them some lovin's, they deserve it. It's hard out here for mama right now, but we will definitely make sure to give you guys more attention, okay? And then come over here and talk to pumpkin, tell him that if he ever does that again, we will literally bop his nose because we cannot deal with him leaving like that, okay? We almost had a heart attack. Who's that? Okay. She might not make it to the toilet, but we're trying really hard. I just want to give the freaking animals some love real quick. Oh, crap. No, go potty, go potty, go potty. Hurry up and go potty. You're fine. You're going to make it. You're going to, hopefully. And then we'll go ahead and give Pumpkin some love, give him a kiss, and give him a hug. And then guess what? It's bath time for all of you, so we're going to have to give bath to Cash. How do we give a bath to the cat? Can we not clean the cat up? He's nasty. Oh, I need to give him a wellness treat. That's what it is. Okay, give him a wellness treat and then we'll go ahead and give Cash a bath because he got all stink. Okay, look at him. Such a cutie pie. After Mr. Cash gets his little bath like he deserves, we're going to come over here and play with the cat wand just a little bit because Pumpkin needs to stop being a brat. <laughs> we do not have time for his running away nonsense, okay? And then we're going to fill both of these bowls. We need to, oh, goodness gracious, okay. We need to refill that one because it's dirty. <laughs> And then we need to see if mom and dad have left any more food in here for us to eat. Of course not, okay. So she's gonna have to go ahead and cook something herself, which isn't so bad. Um, she needs to get her skill up anyways, so it'll be fine. Um, oh, it's three in the morning already, oh my God. Okay, so make some eggs and toast. She literally never gets any sleep. Let me see. <laughs> 
if she has the option, to, if she has enough points to get the seldom sleepy, because I think that would be really good for her. Okay, no, seldom sleepy is 4,000 points. My gosh, okay. So we'll get there eventually, but until then, she is gonna have to sleep all the time because work, working on the farm is hard, hard work. Who's in the shower? <laughs> Oh my god! Cash is sick! Oh, it's just broken. Okay. We need to give Cash a wellness treat as well. Oh my gosh, this is so much to do. This is stressful. She never has time to do anything. Oh my gosh. We'll get there one day, but we're not there yet. Okay, I love that you're trying to give Ruby hugs, but you need to give freaking Cash a wellness treat because he's not well. Okay, please. Oh, little bumpkin. Look at him. Poor thing. Oh, take it better, honey. Oh, lovely. Okay. I It would break my heart. Like, I, I'm sorry. It, even if it's just in The Sims, I cannot deal with it. Okay? I cannot deal with my little babies being sick or anything. And then she's going to have to go do a power nap because it's already 7.30 the next day. She is literally doing terrible so far at this farming life. Um, but it's okay. It's to be expected. She did not expect... Um, to have to take over for her mom and dad. Like, this is completely new for her. It's not something that she expected. She she didn't expect, you know, her parents to pass away so suddenly and her literally be stuck with this farm all on her own. So she doesn't have any clue what she's doing, but she will figure it out eventually. Um, but unfortunately, until then, it's just gonna be, this is gonna be her life and it's it's terrible right now but yeah she'll figure it out um and if you guys are enjoying the episode um and you want to see more of it just go ahead and give me a like consider subscribing and i will see you all in the next episode bye oh okay i don't want to end it on that um so yeah <laughs> if you are enjoying the episode yeah go ahead and give it a like consider subscribing and i will see you guys in another episode Bye! <laughs>